Hi everyone, it's Amber at Prairie Quilt and I want to talk to you about another little fun tip or trick on the Handy Quilter machines. Today is the Moxie machine that comes with an 8 foot loft frame and they now have a Pro Stitcher Light robot for this machine. So it has almost all of the same functions just um, for this smaller machine. So it's really nice. You can still do edge to edge, you can do blocks. So today I'm gonna to talk about cropping designs. Um, so like over here, this was a block design around and I wanted something to fill in the center. And the clamshells came as another just block design. So I'm gonna show you how you can put this in there like that, um, cropping it around. So if you look over here, I did a clover. And let's say that we wanna put different designs in each of the leaves. So I multi-pointed around this leaf, not well, mind you, so don't judge. I did it very quickly. Um, so up here, I have a new area. So I deleted all the areas. This is my new area, which is the leaf. And what you can do, you don't have to have something skewed into that necessarily, which we do love for blocks and things like that, but you can get a little more creative if you'd like. So you can go in and you can pick a design. Maybe it's something, just a part of a design. So if I pick this fancy fan and I like some of the stuff that's going on in here, but I don't want that shape, I'm going to move this over closer to the area and go home so I can see it. And I think that I'm going to shrink up the design just a little bit because I want to include more. So I'm going to go to modify and resize. And if I lock it up, it's going to do length and width, height and width together. So let's just shrink this up a little bit here. Okay. Now, now what I can do is I can just start playing. Let me get this off. And I can move this design in my area wherever I like. So what I want showing in that leaf. So let's say I want to have some of those circles at the bottom, or if you wanted it over here, it can be any part of it that you like. So let's say this is what you like inside that leaf. Put it where you want, go back to your modify. You're gonna to go to crop. You have two options on crop. You can crop outside of your area, or you can crop inside of your area. So I'm gonna crop outside. I'm gonna hit my edges button so it'll clean up as much as possible. And now just that section of the design that I like is going to stitch out inside of my leaf. So uh, we can go ahead and you want to stitch that out. So I'm going to go to my pro stitcher. I'm going to hit run. Now this one does sound a little bit different because it's a smaller. Now remember that I did not multi-point very precisely because I was rushing. So if this was an actual quilt, I would get very close to the edges and do it very nice. So I'm just giving you guys an idea of what you can do.
I came unthreaded, but you can see how it's going to go ahead and fill it in there with just the portion. It would look so cute. And you can do whatever you want. You can do it in different designs. Possibilities are endless. Just play around with it and have fun. We'll see you next month.